are you, sir? Thank you. All right, everybody, welcome to today. So I got a pretty exciting video to share with y'all. I ordered a, actually two mystery boxes from Discmania. I have never in my life opened a mystery box of any kind. Um, so this is very exciting for me and I am ready to just get into them and see what is in store for us. So here we go. I have not opened, obviously this is the, the box. I have not opened this box or any of the other boxes inside of it. So, uh, the main reason why I got these boxes is because there's a DD-1 in there, and I've been really anxious to throw it. Um, these took a lot longer to get in than what I expected, um, but I am excited to start opening them. So, I'm going to do one at a time, we will go from there. box this is a 20% off on your next purchase all right so this okay this is a bar stamp disc mania disc I'm not sure what type of disc this is um, I'm either gonna say an FD FD3 something like that it feels like a fairway driver uh, let's see uh, it is an FD3. Okay, that's sweet. I don't have, I do have an FD3. I probably won't replace this one in my bag, but that is sweet. Here's a, uh, here's a picture of it. There you go. All right, let's see what's next. Oh, wow. Um, this is a, a putter. I'm not sure exactly. I'm going to guess a P2. Here's the stamp. I have not looked at the back of the disc yet. It says X out. It's a logic. Okay, I'm not wrong. Or I am wrong. Um, it's a logic. Okay, sweet. Oh, that's sick. Oh, man. That is so cool. That is a clear disc. I'm going to guess MD3, but I'm not sure. Um... Feels like an MD3. That is a sweet disc. I'm gonna, that, I'll end up losing that. That is, it is an MD3. That is so cool. It's 177 weight. That's a sweet disc. Uh, all right, well, this one obviously tells me right off the bat it's a tactic. Um, extra soft XO Vapor. Wow. Holy cow. Wow. I've never seen it extra soft. XO Vapor. That is, that is, that is extremely grippy. There's a ton of grip on that. And as you can see, it is very soft. It weighs, um, I don't see the weight on it. That's a sweet disc. All right. Here's the, it's a Taylor. I've actually never thrown this disc. It's supposed to be a new mid-range. Um, it's supposed to be fairly neutral. And so, I don't know. I'll make a video about it and see what I think. But this is pretty cool. Whoa. That is a, I can tell it's a majesty, I believe, because of the stamp. It looks like one. It looks like it may glow. It's an active glow majesty. Um, I actually have a majesty. The numbers on this is a 13.5 negative 2.2. I have one, but the majesty that I have does not compute to the numbers. It flies completely different than that so um that's sweet that's a glow disc all right sweet i got a soft link i actually use these i love these discs that is awesome that i got that in there it never hurts to have an extra putter oh 
my gosh. This disc, holy cow. Oh my gosh, this disc is sweet. Okay, this is a, a new Creator Series Cloud Breaker, but it has an X stamp, it's a double stamp on it. That is sweet. That is a great looking disc. I will probably more than likely not bag this disc. I will just put that on my shelf. That is sweet. It's 174. All right, so the whole reason I got the box was for this next disc. <clears throat> it's a DD1. Uh, I don't know what it's gonna look like. I hope it looks sweet, we shall see. I can't see anything because right now it has a sheet of paper under there. So, I cannot see anything. But here we go. I'm nervous, I'm nervous. I hope it's a good looking disc. Okay, just talks about X out. Hmm. Okay, this just talks about the different plastics. That's pretty sweet. Talks about the different plastics and the different discs and that kind of stuff. All right, here we go. Okay, that's sweet. <clears throat> All right, so some people I think are mistaking this and calling it the stratosphere. That's the that's the addition of the disc. The disc is actually a DD1. Um, that is really cool. It has a has a pretty good dome. Not, not like a real big dome to it, but it feels good. Feels nice. I cannot wait to throw this thing. All right, let's get into this next box. Let's see if there's anything else in here. There is. Oh, that's like a little. Uh, Stratosphere pin, like a little. That's a pin. There's a little Stratosphere sticker. So this back in here. I don't know if I will bag any of these. Um, don't know if I'll bag any of those, except for maybe Stratosphere. All right. Into box two. All right. Let me make sure I do this one right. Okay, this one wasn't even taped. I'm on this side. Okay. All right. Got another code here. Another code. Okay. All right. So this is a Jackal. I can't remember what. I think this is an FD. I'm not 100% sure. So it's, it's either an FD or PD. The Jackal stamp is a. Uh, is a, it's a, I guess a sought after stamp. It's pretty sweet. Uh, it's, it's a, it's an FD. Okay. I thought it was an FD. I wasn't sure, but yeah, that's the, that's the jackal right there. That I probably actually may bag because that's, that's pretty sweet. Oh, sweet. I got another soft link. That is sweet. Love links. Um, that is awesome. That's sweet. It has a double stamp. I probably actually may end up bagging that one. That's purple. I like that. <clears throat> all right all right okay so i actually have an essence this is another sweet stamp it's uh essence upside down both ways i actually throw this disc quite a bit mine's white um i think mine's the evolution plastic um but that's a sweet disc i may definitely it's nice to have a backup that's for sure all right let's see I do not know what this is. Okay, this is definitely glow. It has some cards looking here, but I don't know. It feels like a faster mid-range, but it doesn't feel like it's quite a fairway driver. I have no idea what this disc is. I I could not tell you. No idea. I'm guessing six or seven speed, but I really have no idea. It's a magician. It's a 6402, okay. That makes sense. A magician would have cards on it because he does magical stuff. <clears throat> That's pretty sweet. I've never actually thrown a magician. Um, so uh, I'm going to have to give this disc a try. I'll make a video about it and let you guys know how it flies. All right, here's a, here's a logic. It's a soft logic. Um, I don't think I've ever actually tried to put with these. It feels like a P2, real similar to a P2, but um, I've heard good things about them, but I've never actually played with them. All right.
right, here's a Discmania stamp. That's pretty sweet. This is just a wing stamp. Um, I'm guessing an MD-1. It is an MD-1. Um, I like that disc. I actually have an MD-1, um, and I throw it quite a bit. So, um, I like this disc. This is a great disc to have also as another backup. All right, I actually have a disc like this. This is called an Enigma. Um, I've uh, heard it is supposed, the flight numbers are 12-5, negative 1-2. I'm not sure what the flight numbers are on the stratosphere. I'd have to look it up. But to me, they should have similar flight numbers. So I will do a, uh, a flight comparison between this one and this one. Maybe not this exact disc, but my Enigma that I already have, I will throw it and compare the two. I got another Taylor. So this is my second Taylor. Um, I don't know that I need to, but you never know. I could fall in love with it and need a backup. So we'll see. All right, so here is my other uh, Stratosphere. Please be a different color other than blue. Please, please, please. Oh, that's sweet. It's red. That is sweet. It's red Stratosphere. I think I'm really going to like this disc. I cannot wait to throw it. Other than that, I am excited to get out to the course and try some of these discs out. Um, I got some more content coming to you guys soon uh, with me throwing these discs, and I also got some other cool projects going on right now. So um, until then, thank you guys for watching. Go in peace and be blessed.